my channel. I'm Jayla Corian. If you're new, make sure you hit that subscribe button so you're alerted when I post new videos. Today's video is going to be a luxury designer handbag type of haul. Um, I got a few pieces for my birthday. I turned 24 in about five days, so I went to Fifth Avenue and just went into some stores. I did have like a birthday wish list that I posted, so I already kind of knew like what type of handbags that I wanted, what I was eyeing. So when I went into the store and I just saw stuff, I was like, yeah, I already knew I wanted that. 24 is going to be such a magical year year for me because I feel like it's the first year in adulthood that I like really know myself and know what I want know where I want to go I'm comfortable I'm settled I, like I just feel like I'm so at a really really good place right now and I'm excited for like 2019 and what it has to offer so when I turned 23 around this time last year that was the first time I bought um, my first designer item I bought two pair of Christian Louboutins I knew like I wanted a bag but that was like the first thing that I wanted that I just never got myself and then shortly after that I went to Paris and in Paris I just felt like that was my dream to like buy designer pieces like out of the country not in the US so I bought a lot of pieces and some of those pieces I wear literally every single day um, they're some of my faves so once I like dabbled into like designer bags I think I become addicted kind of so luckily I'm not someone that has to have designer clothing like I'm definitely I can do with Fashion Nova and Pretty Little Thing and stuff but as far as like the handbags and even sometimes the shoes I'm like very interested in designer pieces I feel like they can make a look that probably was only $60 put on a little belt add your little bag even some sunglasses I just feel like it like makes your look really like grown sexy luxury ooh, 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 all of that so in this video I'm going to be showing you guys what I got for my birthday I did order two more pieces that's not in this video that has not came in the mail yet but guess what you're just gonna have to subscribe to my channel to see what I got and watch all my videos thanks <laughs> I think maybe when this video go up we're almost at 200,000 subscribers that is my birthday gift from you guys so um, I think we are almost there on this channel so first up is Gucci I got two pieces from Gucci the first piece came in this box so when you open it up it has a Gucci sticker on it I got a bell okay so at the store that I went to they had this belt it is the biggest version of the belt I have this belt in the smaller version so just around like some jeans and you just put it through but I don't wear this belt that much because I feel like all the shirts that I wear they kind of go over my jeans so you don't really see this yeah I'm either wearing high waist jeans or something so I don't wear this that much and I feel like when I do it in the middle like this I just feel like it's a smaller GG, you know, I want it to be a little bit louder. So I got the big one. And when I say this looks so good over top of coats, it looks so good. So I'm about to try it on for you guys so you guys can see. But like, I love this belt. I'm going to be wearing it all the time. So just get ready. I'm going to be belting everything, everything with it. It just makes any and everything look good I promise so this is what this belt looks like let me see what size that I get I got the size 75 because I wanted to be able to wear it like with just a shirt and then I want to be able to loosen it and wear it um, like over a jacket so this is like over a jacket it could go over and then for my small little butt I have to take it in a little bit this is a fave I really really like this it's gonna make anything that I put on just Glam. Chic. And the name of this belt, I believe, is just like the Gigi Marmont. Um, I have the Gigi Marmont bag. So this belt is a thousand dollars, but with like taxes and stuff, it ended up coming out to like eleven hundred, twelve hundred. So that's how much this belt is. My next Gucci piece was just like kind of wrapped up in a wrapping bag, and then it comes in the Gucci satin bag. So the bag that I got is the Gigi Marmont handbag. This comes in multiple sizes. So this is the crossbody bag. And then like they have the other ones with the Gigi Marmont flap and it's an actual flap. But the reason why I like this one, it was because I could wear it on an everyday basis. Now this is their new velvet color. This is in taupe. 
Um, this is their latest color. I didn't want the flat because I already had a flat bag in black. So I wanted a different style. And then on the back, it just has like GG kind of sewn, stitched in. And this will go perfect with my winter coats. I have a lot of browns in my closet. Well, clearly. Um, but I have a lot of browns, a lot of brown jackets. And I just feel like this will go really well. It's a casual bag, everyday basis, on the run, wherever I want to go. So I really, really like this. I love the color. And surprisingly, they were like, this is also a summer bag, although it's velvet. Like the color could transition. So um, I really like this. Now, I can't remember fully, but I believe this bag was $1,200. Um, probably with taxes, it came out to be $1,400 though. Yeah, this is one of the pieces that I've been really wanting. Now, let me tell you, I have been dying to get a Chanel bag. And I really think the reason why I want a Chanel bag is just because it's Chanel. But every time I go, I went to Chanel in Paris. I went to Chanel in Soho. I went to Chanel on Fifth Avenue. And honestly, for $5,000, I just haven't seen a bag that I'm like, oh my God, I have to have this Chanel. So I went, I saw the bags. I was gonna get a black one with like gold hardware, but then I was like, I have a black bag with gold hardware and that's my Gucci. Um, and then I looked at the black with the silver hardware or like the the kind of like gray hardware. And I was like, mm, but I don't wear that many things that is silver. I mostly wear golds. Um, so then I was just looking at some of the bags and I looked at um, some of the wallets and I was like, hmm, I don't have like a nice wallet. So I was like, hmm, maybe I should just get like a Chanel wallet to start out and if I ever really, really want a bag, um, I can get it. Now, if I was to get a Chanel bag, it would definitely be in yellow or pink because I think those, like the actual color ones look the best, but I know I wouldn't wear yellow and pink that often, you know? So I'm just refraining from getting a Chanel right now until I see something, they come out with a color that's just so, oh, so amazing. But yeah, I would either do the yellow or the pink. So maybe like a Valentine's Day gift to myself. I really couldn't resist just having something from Chanel. So I got a wallet. Now, honestly with wallets, I like to be able to see my wallet in my bag at all times. So I don't really carry black wallets because it gets lost inside the bag. I think I'm like a pink wallet girl. So I decided to get a pink wallet from Chanel. Um, this is the medium flat wallet. So the classic Chanel logo with the CCs. They did have this in the boy bag version, but I like the classic. And in the inside, they had different like things in the inside. So either like could open up just like this, and I didn't really like that too much. So I wanted the one that could like open up all the way like this. I like that it had the Chanel logo right here. So I have a cute, you know, wallet now. That's a cute little wallet. And I can see pink. Even my keys are pink because I need to be able to see it when I'm like trying to run with my bag. My previous wallet was like a Ted Baker pink. And I was like, no, like it's a Chanel. I should get black. But I don't like black wallets. So I was like, nah, I'm going to get the Chanel pink. So I got this. And then, you know, down the line, if I do want a pink Chanel bag, I have the wallet. <laughs> So I got this, I'm super happy about this. You know, when I'm pulling out my wallet. <laughs> I'm so silly. The wallet was only $975. For some reason I thought it was gonna be more just because their bags are so expensive, but I guess it's small. So yeah, it was $975, yeah. And the last thing that I got myself for today's video is Fendi. This is my first Fendi purchase and I got the Can I, K-A-N-I, Can I bag from Fendi. And I've been eyeing it because I've been eyeing a nude bag. Like I've been looking in YSL, I've been all everywhere. I've been looking for like a nude bag that is rich and it just is it. So I got this Fendi bag. This is the Fendi Can I with the um, FF like logo on top. And when I was in the store, the person that was working with me, he was telling me that FF is for fur fun or something like that. I just assumed that it was like the Fendi, just Fendi logo. But um, I got this bag. This is actually, they like consider it like a, a gray, but it's definitely like a nude taupe gray type of color. The hardware is a mix of metal, so silver and um, gold. It is 
has a handle on it that you can change out and then in the inside it has the long one that you can like cross over and I think what I like about Fendi is that like well a lot of brands are starting to do this now but they were the first ones to start like doing the changeable handles so like if you want a different feel for your bag you can change out the handles so when you open it up it's a, enough room for all of my shenanigans to go on in my bag as far as my camera lipsticks honey anything now this bag the inside of it I'm gonna have to like try to keep clean because it's like a suede and honey i'd be like spilling stuff in my bag so we gotta be really gentle now this was my biggest purchase i really shouldn't have got this bag but it's my birthday and that just means you know go harder at work jayla like <laughs> go hard play work hard play hard so i got the bag this bag was i'm gonna say it's like 2500 but with tax ends up being 3000 i think maybe it is my most expensive bag but then again i might be lying <laughs> so um I got this bad boy I think it looks just so good like <sighs> this is 100% gonna be my classy girl bag anytime that I'm wearing something like nudish creams and stuff like that my classy girl bag I'm gonna go with her <laughs> alright guys so those are all the things that I got for my birthday um, make sure you guys subscribe to my channel so you guys can see new videos for me and the two other pieces that I got for my birthday and I'm gonna end this vlog here I'm about to go out into the city today have some girl time and I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video bye guys Thanks to me.